Hello, Paradigm people. Welcome to Fitamin Online Workout. I'm JJ Sweeney, and right now we're going to do Mace Workout Part 1. Let's go. All right, ready for your Mace Workout? Let's take the mace with outside hand. You're going to bring it over your opposite shoulder and you're just going to rest it here in this position. Okay. Now you want to feel a nice stretch into your tricep. We're going to do this for about 30 seconds. Using the mace, we have to be really careful how we get into a movement and how we get out. The mace is an incredible tool but must be treated safely. Now take your opposite hand, take the mace, and slowly let it drop down. You're gonna take it on the opposite side and do the exact same thing. So you wanna feel a great stretch into your tricep, and at the back side, you're just letting it drop back. You want your head touching the middle of your back and then your hip as well. So all that is in contact with the mace. So this is a good one to help activate the muscle in your tricep, because we use that a lot when we do the mace. Take your opposite hand and slowly release the mace out. Again, we go back into the other side, but this time, instead of just stretching, you're going to push up and do a tricep extension. So just driving the mace up over your head to straighten out your arm at the elbow. Each movement we're going to do for 30 seconds and then be very careful how you switch sides. So you just want to move to each side nice and carefully. Release it by taking the other hand, catch at the top, bring it around and let's do the other side. Here we go. Now all these movements need to be done safely in control. We don't want to rush, don't want to go too fast. Technique is very important in every training that we do, every movement that we do. Okay, a few more reps. All right, take your trailing hand and just let it come back up. Next movement, we're just going to Grab about halfway down the mace. We're gonna swing it back. We're gonna swing up, catch, toss to the other side. Gonna let it swing back, back up, catch right at the top near the ball head, and bring it down. Swing up, catch, over, and back and down. Very nice. Now you don't wanna toss too high, and if you feel a bit scared, you can just move it across like so here all right next movement we're going to take the mace into this position we're going to bring up into a prayer position switch the hands over and then come back to the opposite side so you're coming up to the center move your hand and come across the body like so You have to get that nice even so you bring it to horizontal position right across both hips. Right, the next movement, we're going to take it, both hands facing front, curl up to your shoulders and drive overhead. This is called lever press. Very good exercise for your shoulder because the ball of the head is dragging you over to one side. So you have to engage your, all the deep muscles in your shoulder joint as well as your core. It's gonna really make you work and challenge you right here. Last one, push, let it down, and then drop. Now we're just going to switch it across to the other side, switch the hands, come up, drive up overhead, and down. Continue to breathe. Very good, drive up and down. Now you should be feeling it more on one side and if you are, that's totally normal because all the weight is over on one side. So it just makes perfect sense as you move through it. 
and slowly bring it back down. Alrighty, this time we're gonna take the mace and do that hand switch to a squat. So we switch and squat, switch, squat, very good. Keep it nice and strong. Very good. Boom. Keep breathing. Get nice and deep in that squat. Last one. All right, let's bring it up here. Now, this time we're gonna take one arm, keeping the bell in the center. You're gonna push up and rotate the mace and bring it all the way back down. Push up and all the way back down. Now we're gonna do two rounds of all these movements. So you'll get a chance to push a little bit harder on the second round. Cause right now we're doing more of learning the movement. All right, now we're gonna switch that around. Catch it on the other side. Just be careful not to hit anyone on the way. Slowly down. And there's a couple of tricky little nuances by using the mace, but this is a great one because it's screwing into the shoulder joint. All the deep muscles are really getting challenged here. Yeah. The more reps you do, the more you're gonna feel that deep burn all the way through your shoulder. Keep going. Nice work, last one. Bring it down, slowly let it drop down to the ground. Now you're gonna bring it behind your back this time. With both hands, you're gonna just swing just outside the hip, all right? So just continue. We call this pendulum. You wanna keep your hands nice and deep in the, in the back of your head and just continue to let it swing across. Thank you Paradigm people for joining our online workout. I hope you enjoyed it. Continue to keep yourself strong and healthy. And if you want to continue the workout, please press the link below.